So for some reason there's a gap missing, so obviously something belongs in here, and I don't know what. So anyway, shelf three, we've got the Haunting in Connecticut. Haunting in Connecticut two, Ghosts of Georgia. And Haunted House, um, it's pretty much just like one of the scary movie ones. It's not too bad, actually. We've got Hellraiser, um, Hellbound, um, just number two. Um, I think this transfer is not a very good transfer. It was very black grainy in that, so not a very good transfer. Elo Ross, Hostile, um, Hostile, Part 1, 2, and 3. Um, I've only seen number one, but I do love it. House in the Street, um, not a bad film. I do like it. I um, absolutely love Jennifer Lawrence, brilliant actress. Um, and yeah. But I think yeah, that's just one. If you're not. If you've got mates over who aren't big into horror, that's probably one that you can romp on. We've got an um, Italian film, I believe. Um, the House, House by the Cemetery. Haven't seen. I do plan on doing one day, one day an Italian night and a Spanish. Like Italian, Mexican, Spanish. So I love those those ones. Oh, we've got House of Wax. Love this film. Everybody in this infant, the whole Paris Hilton dying, and this was absolutely brilliant. We all love this movie for one for that reason. <laughs> in fact, that it was actually a really good film. I was really hoping that there was gonna be a remake. Not a remake, sorry, um a sequel. I think this came back in like two thousand and five. Around 2005, I believe, so I would have been about 12. I was really happy for like a remake. Not really, uh, um, sequel. In Bread, not a big fan of this film. Um, I know the guy I went to uni with absolutely, I think he really did enjoy it, but it's disappointing. Insidious, not much to say about this film. Brilliant. James Wan is a master. Insidious 2, um, and yeah, not as good as the first one, but still bloody good. Can't wait for the third. Which I believe people have already seen. And I've got a Spilling Your Grave 2. I have not seen this one either. I've seen the original and the remake though. The Last Exorcism. Um, what can I say? Just another Exorcism movie. We've got The Last Exorcism Part 2. Which is it was alright. I forget what I thought of them. I forget what I thought about this one, but yeah. Another Australian film called The Lemon Tree Passage. Um, yeah, no, it's not that good. This film, <laughs> I didn't really, yeah, I didn't really enjoy it. Um, another, a vampire film called like, The Right One. In um, absolutely love this film. Bloody brilliant. It's just such a good vampire film. I mean, it's not as good as Twilight, but what is? What vampire movie is not as good as Twilight? I mean, Twilight's brilliant, eh? Yeah, yeah. Hope everybody can note the sarcasm in my voice. Anyway, next we've got Jack Ketchum's The Lost. Um, I haven't seen this one because of it's in another region. In through, I've got an all region Blu ray player. I've just got to plug it in and, yeah, <laughs> one day watch it. But yeah, um, Jack Ketchum's also the guy who done, um, the Girl Next Door, that horror movie, and that was bloody brilliant. Then we got another um, Spanish film called um, Mama, which I absolutely love. I, I, I really do enjoy this film. Um, probably Spanish Spanish horror films is like one of my favourite foreign films. But yeah, that's in English though, that one. The, the short film of which that's based off is not in Spanish. The original Maniac, which I've not watched yet, and I haven't watched the re remake either, so I've got to sit down and do that one day. We've got Maniac with Eli Eli Elijah Wood. We've got Messenger 2 and so Solist. Solist, um, I've seen. Have I seen? Yeah, I've seen both. Um, I forget what that was like. They're all both. Uh, but I picked this up for like six, six, seven dollars at I think six bucks at JB. So for two films like that, I don't care. And then, they're still they're worth that. We got Mist, Sim King. I'm not. I don't. I think I've seen this, but I haven't seen. I was like, pretty young when I saw it. But anyway, that is shelf three, and I will be back with the with the next shelf. Yeah, so that was shelf three. If you've seen any of them on the films on that, let me know and I'll get 
yeah, comment below if you've seen them ones and what you thought about them. And I will see you later. Bye.